your art gets out there. And, uh, so, I mean, in my case, uh, I went through a whole long period where you had to go and you to go from gallery to gallery. Like, you know, here's my stuff. You know, you want to study it. Well, you know, we got like a backlog of like 400 files to look at before we get to yours. So you're like, oh, geez, you know, how am I going to finally get my stuff out there? So uh, a lot of the uh, the social media effect, which you get your art out internationally, like really fast. And in my case, uh, I can say that since I started my website about five years ago with the Facebook page, uh, I have probably sold about how many paintings? About <laughs> about forty per year. Oh, yeah, about forty pieces a year, basically. So that's that. That's part of the business. So is the business of art in galleries? Uh, yes and no. Uh, there's the, the plus side about galleries is that you have very interesting collectors who will look out for art and they'll be looking for the next big up and coming person. Okay, because if these people are investors, what they want to do is they want to buy a piece of art at a thousand and sell it back at two hundred thousand. That's the goal. Do they like the piece? That's, a, that's very subjective to them. So that's the world of galleries. It's very difficult to get in. Galleries will often um, pigeonhole you as an artist and say, okay, so if Steve Otis gets into an art gallery with this kind of painting, that's all they want. 